So you crack your egg and you uh, put the uh, egg whites aside because you're just using the egg yolk. And for our first batch, we're using four eggs. Is that what we're doing? Yeah, it's uh, either a large egg or two. Oh, so we're just using a couple eggs. We're making twice. Yeah. A little bit of lemon juice and right. some salt and some vinegar. But so we got that in there. Set, okay. Set your egg yolks aside. Put them in the fridge. We need lemon juice. Here's a lemon. Squeeze it on in there. And hopefully, I don't get any seeds in there. This is a really overly ripe lemon. There, that's enough. And I want whatever, a tablespoon or so. That's a teaspoon. There we go. A little bit of garlic powder. Okay, that's good. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of mayo yeah, coming from this. And then, like a dash of uh, cayenne. Whoa! That's too much! <laughs> okay, sorry. Too much. You want to take it and mix it with a whisk. You're going to be using the whisk for quite a while. So you're going to whisk it up pretty good. Yeah. And then you need a cup of oil. And the ratio is supposed to be about one large egg to about three quarters of a cup. So we got uh, four small eggs in a cup, so we might use a little bit more oil. But the trick is, you can't pour it in fast. You gotta drizzle it in real slow, and you've gotta um, mix it in time. It's called an emulsifier. Word for the day: emulsifier. Ooh, I just poured too much in there. Whoops. Um, so some extra notes on the mayonnaise: it'll only keep for about two days. Um, maybe three if you use lemon juice. Uh, normal mayonnaise has a preservative in it called EDTA that's kind of poisonous. It allows it to last for weeks and months.